I've been using watercolour and inks in many of my sketchbook pieces for years. Hi, I'm Omar and this sketchbook is my 21st sketchbook which I have dedicated specially to wildflowers which has allowed me to explore ways of adding more depth and textural interest in my botanicals. My florals have appeared on cards, wrapping paper, gift bags and fabric. This class is a relaxed exploration of expressive florals laid down in watercolour with essential inky details on top. As a top teacher here on Skillshare, many students have wondered how I seemingly achieve effortless watercolour florals which stay vibrant and fresh rather than too tight or overworked. But how do we go about doing this? In this class, I will share insights and best practices for producing expressive watercolours, including clearing the headspace for our flowing florals. By using playful exercises, we can shift our attention from the need to portray accurate depictions and instead simplifying it down to capture the essence of your flower. As a recovering perfectionist, creating artworks in watercolour and ink appeals to my personal taste and capabilities as it allows me to have the balance between the carefree side of me and the need for a few details. The guiding principles I present, like shape, value and colour mixing tips, can be applied easily to any subject matter you decide to paint and still achieve the same spontaneous results. Big brushes and vibrant colours can take centre stage in this approach, along with bolder contrast and descriptive ink lines. There are three full-length demonstrations in which I take you through my entire process. Whether you're just starting out with watercolours or are well versed in this medium, I will present a really unique and intuitive way of working that will produce enchanting wildflower depictions.